put this this thing on. Yeah, okay. Hello. <clears throat> Hello, I'm back for a day five. Day well, this is covering day four and five of uh confessionals. Ooh la la. Uh my camera works now. Are you excited? Are you excited? That's what I thought. You're excited. Yeah, you better be. Fucking camera's working. You better be excited, bitch. And, um, I wouldn't say I forgot yesterday, but, uh, I fell asleep. And I woke up, like, maybe one o'clock. I fell asleep again. Whatever. Um, what happened yesterday? We, we, um, I narrowed it down from, I think Super and Crow both, one of them suggested Ryan, one of them suggested uh, Duck, and I just pinged them both and narrowed it down to that, and that's what happened. Um, I tried to get Ryan out, to keep Duck in, the conflict of Duck versus Logan, I want, that was the only conflict that existed, so I wanted that to stay in as long as possible. Apparently, today was as long as it was gonna go. Um, so, ended up Ryan and Duck tied. And apparently, some people voted for me, because Colin said I was so close. And I thought, well... That surely that means the person I voted for almost got eliminated, right? There's two ways we could be this could be taken. Either the person I voted for almost got eliminated, or I almost got eliminated. And if it's the first one, I don't want to tell people because I don't want any momentum behind voting me out. But if it's the second one, maybe I could tell people and we could, you know you know, confirm that and figure out what it was. Um, I thought it was the second one because a bunch of people who had voted for Ryan and Duck came forward saying that they got the message. And then Tess got the message. And I'm like, well, Tess, who did you vote for? And Tess says, I didn't vote for anyone. That's a lie. That's a bold-faced lie. All you have in the circle is your vote. And you're going to tell me you didn't vote for anyone? The only reason you're not going to vote for anyone is if there's already a tie and you just want them both dead. But you ha all you have is your vote, man. Vote for someone. You're going to tell me. You're going to tell me. Winner of circle and fourth place in other circle. Tess. LGBT tessellation has <sighs> you're gonna tell me that she didn't vote for someone I call BS you voted for someone you're trying to make it seem like I didn't <sighs> like there's momentum behind voting me out Maybe she did want a tie between Ryan and Duck. But still, there's you can't do that when there's no tie. Because you don't know what the fuck is going to happen. Votes can spring out of nowhere. If enough people abstain, you can go. Just because you didn't vote. Just quit abstaining. Vote. Ugh. It's such a bad move. No person in the right mind is going to abstain, at least before a tie. If you get to final three and you get both people to vote for each other, because I just thought of this, like, earlier in the day. If you get to final three and you get both people to vote each other, you can just abstain. And then they go into a tie and you abstain again they both die. That's, that's a good reason to abstain, but in any... A lot of other, like, before there's a tie even involved in just about any other situation, abstaining just isn't a good idea. 
you need your vote. Anyway. Next. Um, I swear, I tea, like, Tess is BSing a lot of this. I'm... Um, mm, no. There's just things Tess says that I point out in my confessional. I'm like, really? Really? I don't know. Call me a pre-gamer, but I saw those... Those results to the circle, those other circles, and now I got my eye on Tess, so maybe I'm putting Tess under a microscope, but Tess does seem suspicious. Keep her around for a bit. Take out the inactives. So, we ended up with a tie between Ryan and Duck. And because of this, we had to vote for someone... In the tie, I was thinking about just abstaining to let them both die. If there was a tie again. But if I did that and I encouraged people to do it, um, no one would save me in the tie. And I don't want people to know that's a thing they could do. With multiple people going out at the same time. So... I'll just pretend it's rocks. If there's, a, no, if there's another tie. And people who don't understand circles will just think it's rocks. And they won't want to do that. A double tie. That'll be a bad idea. Who the fuck wants to go to rocks? If you know you can kill multiple people at once, hell yeah, you want to tie tie all the time. If it's rocks, don't want to tie. That's the thing. Like, uh, people are gonna put me in ties and not save me if I, if they think they can kill me and other people at the same time. So. Anyway, um, it was between Doc and Ryan. I voted for Ryan, tried to keep Doc in, so we keep the Duck versus Logan thing. Um, then today, the Duck versus Logan fight, it, it didn't, it was no longer a snail's pace. It was, it was going real fast. Um, it was a lot to read. I didn't, I didn't end up reading all of it. There was so much, but I read, I think, most of it. I got the gist of it. Um, yeah, I, I got extremely personal. And... Parts of it was pretty funny, but, <laughs> um, the parts of it were really ugly, so, I don't know, it's a mix. Uh, me being evil Dan, I laugh at <laughs> things I shouldn't be laughing at, but that's just me. Um, I think the whole... The whole guilt tripping the entire chat was kind of not ideal. Um, if it, I mean, I could see, like, before Duck went, that being a strategic move of, hey, this is a problem, let's get Duck out. And then your enemy goes and you're like, okay, I'm calm now. Yada yada. Um, but, no, Duck, Duck went and Logan kept going, and this, this was not a strategic move, he was, he, he was off the rails, and, I mean, it, it was like, it was IRL stuff, so it's like, beyond the org, but if it, if it upset you that much, I would think you wouldn't want to try to get 21 people who are trying to beat the crap out of you in an org to try to console you. Because one, if they did console you, 
How do you know that's genuine? They're playing an org. Two. Um. Most org players don't want to console you. I'm, I'm going to say that right now. You, do you, like, do you understand, <laughs> like, the, the un-shit-giving attitude that SS has? Ah. Uh, I mean, I'm sure Logan figured that out. Logan was, um, very, very upset. And I don't think Logan can win now. Logan will have a very tough time getting himself out of that. Whether his anger was justified or not, perception is everything, and he will have a, a hell of a time trying to dig himself out of that one. Um, I don't like the guilt-tripping tactics. Um, in just a normal setting, I despise it. I don't, I don't like it. Like, if I, if I know you and I, like, actually trust you, then, like, we can have a conversation, but, like, if you're just trying to guilt trip me, then it is, like, I'm not, I'm not gonna deal with your shit. It's just, it's just a dick move. And as a strategic move, it's, it means, there's real dick strategies out there, let me tell you that. It, it could be acceptable. Um, but it wasn't a strategic move, and you could tell it wasn't a strategic move, because after Duck left, he kept going, and you know, he just said fuck you to everyone in the whole s server, or maybe not the whole server, but everyone that was in the chat, all the players and whatnot. I just, I sat back and just watched it happen. Um, for a little bit, and then, like, halfway I had to go do something else, and then, like, I came back, and I kept reading, reading it. I should, I should have got popcorn. I was gonna, like, watch, um, probably, like, Pirated Survivor or something, but I went on to go to Discord. And I started reading it, like, okay, I'm gonna read, I'm gonna read the, catch up on what's happening in the circle, and then I'm gonna go do something, like, to watch Survivor. Um, I went through the whole bowl of popcorn. <laughs> there was so much shit. It was interesting, though, I gotta say. Um, we've, we've now reached, um, a part, a phase in the circle where there, there's conflict. And Logan currently is gonna be the, the center of. A lot of a lot of the early conflict I think I don't think he's gonna be here for long enough to be the center of the conflict I don't know if there can be a center of the conflict in a circle because the center of the conflict goes pretty quickly but for the early conflict I think he'll be a center of the conflict until when, once we run out of inactives his ass will probably most likely be grass um, so, <laughs> sucks to be him. Um, yeah, I mean, it's a public chat. If it, like, <laughs> go somewhere else. I'm just, like, let's just, just, you can't. Try to get 20 other people, or 21 other people to, like, just console you simultaneously. It's not gonna happen. It's, like, the, on, the only the only player chat that they have. So if they want to talk about something, they're gonna talk about something. And not everything is about you. What Logan did was extremely... Attention seeking. And. I don't know. Maybe this is me. Because I don't. I don't like. I, I, I feel like an asshole if I do that. 
but whatever. It it is partially Logan's fault because although <laughs> Duck was instigating it. Uh, Logan, Logan is very easily instigatable, so, it, like, part of it is his fault for being, like, just, <sighs> if he just ignored it, it would have stopped a lot, a lot quicker, I, I wouldn't say that, the fact that he kept going back and forth with Doug, like, it sealed Doug's fate, but it also sealed Logan's fate. And I'm thinking maybe Duck wanted Logan out of the game and doing this, n like knowingly figuring out a way to upset Logan at its core, maybe that was part of Duck's plan to just have a last ditch effort of fucking over Logan. Um, which strategically, okay. Um... On, on both ends, it was it was kind of ugly. But it was okay. It's, okay, it's... It's weird, because... <sighs> I don't know. You have, like, two irrational forces arguing, and it's... One's... One of them is irrationally like emotional or whatever and maybe maybe not irrationally emotional i mean like depending upon how recent that death was but duck is definitely ir <laughs> irrationally like i'm not sure emotional but <laughs> irrationally memeing <laughs> oh gosh I'm evil I don't know why I keep talking about this the, the situation's done um anyway the vote now um a bunch of people wanted to vote out Logan and I expected that to happen because Logan was a huge center of attention. Logan wanted an inactive gone, so I asked him, Okay, if you don't want to go, who do you think we should vote for? Because I tried to push the blood on him. I wanted him to get the blood on his hands. And then he's like, No, no, you guys can figure that out for yourselves i just don't want to go so i'm like okay what about serpy and they're like was serpy in this game I'm like yeah he's in this game I'm like okay that's a good point I, I don't remember him ever being here and everyone's like yeah yeah let's vote out serpy but that's not the point the point is people keep pushing the blood back to me tess did it logan did it maybe i shouldn't be willing to do it I'm going to get targeted at some point. And part of me wants to take out Logan just for pushing the blood out back to me. But I want to take out Tess first for doing that. I think... I don't know, I don't know if I talked about this in my, the, the other confession. I don't remember when this happened, but... I think... Yeah, because I was like, who do we vote for? Because I pinged both Ryan and Duck, and they both responded and, like, had some very minimal defense that wasn't really convincing at all, but they were just about equal in defense. And I'm like, okay, who do we vote for? And then Tess says, I don't know, throw out a name. I'm like, God, Tess, no, I was asking you. Why are you asking me? I asked you. <laughs> Why do I have to be decisive? You can target me for being decisive. <laughs> That's why I'm targeting Tess. At some point. Not right now. But Tess will go. Um. 
we'll have to keep Tess around a little bit because I don't think Tess is going to get in any fights. If I'm being honest, Tess will probably slide under the radar just like me. But at some point, the both of us will realize that we are the competition to our games. Um, If we both make it that far. I'm not sure if I'll make it that far. <laughs> because I'm, I'm too evil, I guess. Um, oh, but if we do make it that far, I think we'll both end up realizing, hey, we gotta vote out the other guy. Um, but we'll see what happens with that. Um, what else? Uh, test, test, test. Um, Logan pushed the blood back to me, and, yeah, I'll keep Logan in for a bit, um, he's gonna start fights, and that's what I need to survive, is people starting fights, people, people been, have been a little too pacifistic in this circle, Keeping Logan is the best thing for my game. Because he's going to start fights. And I need fights to slide under the radar. Because if there are no fights, I can't slide under the radar. Fights bring new targets to the table. More fights, more targets. That, that's how I see it. More fights there are, more I can survive. That's it. So, I need Logan to stay as long as possible. I'm playing with fire, because he can fight with anyone. He could fight with me. But, I'm willing to play with that fire if he's the only person willing to fight people. Ugh. Even said it was part of his strategy to fight people. Because that's why I thought it was a strategic move to get Duck out. But it wasn't. It was personal. My God. <laughs> anyway. Um, so Serpy's gonna go out because Serpy's inactive. At least I, I'm pretty sure Sir no one has a problem of voting out Serpy. I'm pretty Serpy was less active than some of the other people that have been voted out so far. So except for Dark, because Dark Dark said nothing. Nothing, nothing at all. Literally nothing. I don't even know what the, what the fuck is Dark do. Hold on, hold on, I'm gonna search this up. Has Dark said Anything, anything at all, since the start of the circle. What is it? Let's switch this up. No. Ten, uh, eleven, eight was his last message. What the? I get. I guess Dark was good in season six, and then he just he just he joins the season, and he fucks off. I know. Like if I get the whole like. You got IRL stuff. I think, was he moving or something? I think that someone said he was moving. Um, I get him having to, like, you know, dwindle out of All-Stars being inactive. But, but, hear me out. If you do that, and then you come back, and then you apply for an early season, you do the same thing, you're just an inactive player. I don't understand inactives. Why do you go and apply to multiple seasons just to not play in them? What's the point? Why are you there? You're not doing anything. You, it's not, how is it fun to just not do anything? Why do you apply to multiple things? Ugh. That's, I, don't, I don't understand what the point is. I don't. Anyway, is there anything else I should cover? I'm trying to think. I think I've covered everything off the top of my head. 22 people remain, 21 after Serpy's gone. We'll have to find another scapegoat inactive. Um, 
I'm gonna keep Logan in. And yeah, that uh, that is the state of the game right now. Paka comrades.